This week in iPixel Skyblock, a few things happened, and in this video, I'll be covering most of them. A few of the items were disabled, like redstone, the bazaar, the hex, the gemstone grinder, but they have been re enabled. Some of the other bug fixes were they fixed Lonesome Miner for the two people that used it, they fixed the slime hat anti knockback glitch. They also fixed the slime blocks not compacting into enchanted slime balls, which I didn't even know was a thing. Then they fixed the silverfish, and the silverfish puzzle being killable. And finally, the NPC cell limit was removed, but it has now been set back to 200 mil. They have added a new type of fishing, called chum fishing, or chumming to be exact. All you have to do is go to the mushroom desert, and you'll find the chumming NPC. Did you know that the chumming NPC is a reference to Moby Dick? So how it works is, you place a chum bucket beside you and start fishing. With a regular rod, you get chums from sea creatures. But if you have a chum rod, you get chums from anything. 10 chums fill up a bucket, which can then be traded in for some stuff. Also, you need glowing mushrooms, which can be obtained by punching mushrooms with particles. We have a new ultimate enchant, called Bobbing Time, which is a new armor ultimate enchant that requires a lot of stuff. Now most of the items can be easily obtained through simple crafts, but you also need a Bobbing Scripture, which can only be obtained from the Yeti, Sea Emperor, Grim Reapers, or Lord Jabus. There's also a new fishing enchant that gives more fishing speed, and a new fishing reforge called Pitching Koi, that gives less sea creature chance, but more fishing speed, compared to Salty. We also have new fishing based equipments, and the submerged reforge now gives fishing speed. And finally, the dolphin and the ammonite pet got a few tweaks, which makes ammonite the best pet for chumming. Master Tao's test of control has finally been enabled, which makes getting black belts much easier. You can complete it by staring at the wither skeleton, and you'll know if you are doing it correctly, based on the block on its head. Coal gives 0 points, iron gives 3 points, gold gives 6 points, and diamond gives 10 points and adds a second on your time. But getting diamond every time is hard, as it spawns skeletons, zombies, and decoys of itself to sabotage you. So you'll need to dodge the arrows, knock the zombies away from you, and keep looking at the real wither skeleton, meaning the one that doesn't have the particles. Coal got buffed, and his second perk gives 75 mining wisdom, and the mining fiesta event gives 50 mining wisdom, instead of multiplying your wisdom by 1.5, which should be a massive buff to mining XP. They buffed the enchanting skill to give more XP per enchanted bottle, and finally, they nerfed the Holy Dragon armor to give less health regen, but it now has a greater range. There's a secret location near the Chumming NPC. Now I don't know what it's for, but it is there. How did I enter, you might ask? Well... While I was editing the video, the admins deleted trillions of coins from the economy. They made perfect and flawless gemstones unstackable so if you have a stack of these gemstones you will lose 63 of them. Most regular players don't have stacks of gemstones unless you're a duper. But you still may have been gathering a few perfect gemstones for your max devon setup. So a big F for you. This update didn't affect me much. But I'd like to hear your thoughts on it please tell me in the comments. If you watched the video up to this point, I sincerely thank you. If you want to watch more videos like this, click the button on the left. If you want to continue watching my content, click the button on the right. And don't forget to leave a comment as I read all comments.